Today I'm going to show you how to install the Health Watch with your Android. So let's get right into it. So first of all, you got to find the app called Play Store. Uh, as you could see, it's on my own page already. It's called Play Store. But if you can't find it, simply scroll up on your Android. Go on the search bar here on top and just type Play Store. There it is. You can see the app right there. So I'm going to press on that. This is the first page you're going to see. So press on the search bar at the top and simply type the fit with a space, press search. And this is the app we need to install. So boom, I press on install over here. I'm going to install it. Um, so as you can see, it's already installed. It takes about, you know, five seconds, not even it's installing right now. It takes about five seconds to download and about, you know, 10 seconds to install, depending on the phone and depending on your connection. Obviously, it's going to be different for everybody. Um, there it is. It's already installed. So I'm going to open it right now. As you can see, this is the app. So it's going to ask for your, you know, gender, birthday, height, weight. I'm going to skip all of that just, you know, for the sake of this tutorial. Now I ask, allow the fit to accept your photo media on the, your device. I'm going to do allow, especially if you want to, you know, send pictures to your watch or change the background of your watch. Make sure you press allow on that. Now, boom, this is the first page that you're going to see. It says on the top, add smartwatch to get more health information. So you're going to press to add. Now I ask for your location. Uh, this is really important for uh, the weather the, uh, the weather option on the, the you know the watch. So I'm gonna press on uh, uh, allow this time. Now there it is. It's gonna ask for the smartwatch list on the phone. As you can see, it pops right here Y22. So I'm gonna press on that. As you can see, it's trying to connect on the watch now. So to make sure it's properly connected, go on the second tab of the application. As you can see on the bottom, there's a watch icon. So press on that, and there you see it says connecting. Boom, it's finally connected. So as you can see, it's connected with the phone now. Now to make sure everything is good, go on notifications over here. And if you want to connect the health watch with your phone and receive phone calls and be able to answer with the health watch, you're going to check the phone option right here. Now you need to allow permissions on your phone. So allow the fit to access your phone call logs, do allow. Allow the fit to set your contacts, allow. Allow the fit to make and manage phone calls. Obviously, this is, you know, to make the functions available. So you do allow. And there it is. It's finally checked. So now if you receive phone calls on your phone, it's going to pop on the health watch and you'll be able to talk to people on your well, on your uh, health watch directly. You could do the same thing for messages. Check that in. Allow the send of you SMS messages. Allow. Now you could be able to see messages on your uh, device, on your health watch. And there's other application here as well. I'm not going to do everything. It's just to show you guys the basics and how it works. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. It's not really that much complicated. You could change the watch faces over here. There's a lot of options. You could also press on more watch faces and there's a lot more options here that's gonna pop off. It's gonna take a second to load here. But uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it. Um, I'm not gonna go too much in details because obviously this is not a application uh, discovery. It's more like how to install the health watch. So obviously I'm not gonna stay here because there's a, about more than a thousand uh, watch faces gonna appear here. It's gonna take a long time to load uh probably about a minute or so so i'm not gonna waste you guys time um, i'm just gonna end the video right here so thank you for watching and i'll see you guys on the next tutorial if you have any questions or comments drop them down in the comments below and we'll be happy to answer you for you guys so take care